We were in Chester, New Hampshire, and we were about to look at scarecrows first. We got a nice view from the road. This is the village of Chester. This right here, we're looking at some scarecrows. This one looks so, so nice, even though when he's driving an older Different antique camp, car, yeah. you know? I know, I have... I... Here's the road. Let's zoom in over here. All right, let's stop right here. Here we have a couple of scarecrows out of the picnic. Sorry about that little, <laughs> about to say the little motorcycle, but. I got some more right here. We're going to keep on going. Lion of the Year. This right here is a scarecrow with a license plate that says it's five o'clock somewhere. You know that. We'll take a look at these uh, four. Alice in Wonderland. This is the Alice in Wonderland scarecrows. Alice and the Mad Hatter do some work. They really got This is right off of um, Route 102 and Route 121. And that right there is a church. There's a pumpkin right there on the bench. All right. There's the sign for Chester, New Hampshire. Oh, Elvis, yeah. Oh, look at that. This is Elvis. And here's um, here's a couple more right up here. Look at this. Elvis has left the building. Wow. This is more exciting. All right, let's keep rolling on. Oh, the one for, um, I meant to say these scarecrows are Beauty and the Beast. That's the Beauty and the Beast scarecrow, but look at this one. Look at this. And we got little ducks. I wonder what this is. That's right. Charlie Brown and Lucy Scarecrow.
So, what is your favorite um, creative scarecrow? Do you guys love Elvis, Charlie Brown, or Beauty and the Beast? They have very good scarecrows that they um, do want to make out of, so like any creations for, you know? Or like making your own art of um, scarecrows in, um, you know, art class, you know? So every time when you drive by, always make sure that the scarecrow will definitely look after you, you know? The scarecrows will definitely keep an eye out on you, you know, even though when you're driving. All right, let's continue on with the, um, the group. Once upon a time, there was Pinocchio. I think that's Pinocchio. This right here is the Chester Public Library. Oh, wow. This is awesome. Who do I have? We got Heidi and Brenna. The Cat in the Hat Scarecrows. This right here is the Cat in the Hat Scarecrows. All right, there's the um the church, and it's safer. We're gonna do a little bit of jogging, except no one's coming. But there is. But you just need to be um, careful. See if I can. I, I don't think this is okay, but if I can try to. Uh, here's a scarecrow. We have a U.S. woman scarecrow right here. There is more down here. <laughs> so I think Brenda's going to read out a fortune, but look at this. Aim ramp at press, press the red button. Hmm. Not sure what it does, but it's not normally real, but it's only pretend that they made it. Here's another one. This has to be a pirate. Oh, Captain Hook, okay. This is Peter Pan. Yeah, I see. For the, and for some strange reason, his shoe was off, and his thing is right here on that bench, in that branch. Oh, yeah, I see. All right, we'll continue in just a second. All right, well, not a whole bunch to see back here, well... What do you guys think about the Scarecrows? What I like is the Peter Pan and um, the Elvis one. Those are one of my favorite Scarecrows to see, but this is a nice little village of Chester, New Hampshire. So I hope you guys enjoyed this wonderful little walk around of looking at all the Scarecrows in Chester, New Hampshire. Any questions or concerns, please make sure to like and subscribe and stay tuned for more updates. So for that being said, all I need to say now is, that's it, folks.